What's going on guys? In this video, I'm gonna be sharing with you a very special tip. This is gonna help you absolutely get some pressure in Madden 22 Next Gen. Now I'm on Madden 21 Current Gen, but I want you to know that I've tested this out in the game of Next Gen. Um, we just can't capture anything until the game officially launches. This is a really, really, really good blitz that you can use. And I wanna really frame this up as a blitz that is really, really good, specifically against this gun tray or trips tight end. This is a trips tight end major, 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 really, really, really effective blitzing concept. So the play comes to us out of the big nickel over G. If you wanna get my big nickel over G um, route concepts or concepts, that's in the description. We're gonna be uh, releasing a new big one, new uh, big nickel over G defense in just a couple of days. Real quick, if you've not subscribed, make sure to do that. I'm gonna be streaming Madden 22 action later this evening um, for you guys. Also, if you wanna get free offenses and defensive schemes sent to your cell phone every single week, Again, completely free, meta-tested offensive and defensive schemes that pro players are using, that I'm using, that some of the best players in the community are using. Text the word MADDEN to 208-218-6900. Again, pull your cell phone out right now. Text the word MADDEN to 208-218-6900. And we're actually gonna choose one of you guys and give you a free uh, MADDEN 22 uh, winner's kit, which is our offensive and defensive guide. Okay, so big nickel over G. We're just going to come out in the play cover four quarters. It doesn't matter what play you come out in, really. You just want to run run the stock plays, whether it's cover two, cover four quarters, something like that. It doesn't matter, again, what specific play you're calling. But cover four quarters, let's go over this. I want you to look at a really important thing. Really, really important. So I'm going to pinch my line, and I'm going to show my blitz, show blitz, just like this. Now I want you to look at where this linebacker is sitting. If you take a look at this linebacker, you see that he's over the top of the slot corner. This is kind of a traditional way that you're going to fend out of trips tight end. So what I like to do is simply run him off the line of scrimmage and put him on a blitz, just like that right there. And then you're going to be able to then use her this guy, and then you can basically send your pressure. So for example, if I want to defend, if I wanted to defend the running back on a table route, I could man that guy up over there, and then I got quarters across the board. And at the snap of the ball, you're going to see that this five-man pressure is really, really, really fast really really good pressure this is something that's going to be better about mountain 22 um, in terms of next gen versus current gen so i can bring this guy pretty much as close as i want and as you can see here i can contain rush i just want to make sure that i get him kind of on the line of scrimmage so that he comes in really fast and again for the blitz all i'm doing is standing right here i'm just kind of getting the center attention and you see we're either going to run through the b gap or we're going to run some edge heat now, I want to show you uh, what to do when your opponent blocks a running back, which is very common. So if they start to block a running back and that's their adjustment, this is why I like this so much because you can bring this guy off the edge, but then I can also quickly hot route that safety over there to a blitz just like this. And now I've got six-man pressure coming right at the quarterback, real smooth, real simple, and we're going to get really good pressure really quickly against the quarterback. Let me show you that one more time. One of the little disadvantages, in my opinion, at least to the next-gen side of things, um, in terms of the way the practice mode is going to work, is it doesn't give us great tells as far as where we need to stand from a user perspective. I'm hoping that 22 is going to be a little bit different, uh, and kind of more back to what current Gen Man 21 was. I think it does actually, but anyways, let me just show you. So again, we're just blitzing off this edge. I would even slide this guy in just like that, double contain rush off the edge. And then now you're going to see that I'm going to come in here and I'm looking for these uh, shadows. Where do I want to stand? As you can see right here, I can stand right in this area, or I could even stand over here. But again, running backs blitzing or blocking. I'm just coming down just for a second. And as you can see, we're completely screaming at the quarterback every single time. So um, this is also a really good play if you want to get some pressure against a block running back and a block tight end out of uh, out of trips tight end. I'm going to show you how to do it right here. So again, we're going to blitz these guys off the edge just like this. Every single time we're going to bring them down, really get them close in there. It's actually something that is going to be very effective in Madden 22. So let's say they do something like that. All we're going to do is we're going to man the user up onto the running back side and we're going to kind of stand right here what we're trying to get is the running back to basically follow our user to the right and right there they actually picked us up pretty well but we're still able to get a quick shed and get the pressure in so let me show you that one more time and again this is real simple this is out of big nickel i just think i've never i've never done this before i kind of found this off the cuff but putting that linebacker down there as opposed to trying to blitz the slot corner to me is so, so, so subtle, but it's so daggone effective. Again, you want to get these guys in as best as you possibly can. And you, I ideally like to user this uh, this this running back. So I like to man him up on the running back so the running back kind of um, attracts himself to him. And, and I'm just going to run basically at the running back. Oh, I see they block. Okay, then I'm going to bail out and cover this middle of the field. As you can see, we're able to get the pressure. So 
Um, that is the big nickel over G kind of money pressure that you can run against strip side in. It's a very specific thing against strip side in. Normally, this is not how you run big nickel over G, but in this example, this is, uh, again, a lot of people are going to be running. Um, another thing you can also do is you can kind of slide this guy off just like this. And again, you can just add people. So if they're gonna if they're gonna block or they're gonna start to notice they're gonna block everybody, then I can put those two guys in coverage. Now all I gotta do is come over here and, and basically use the middle of the field. And we got instant pressure. So the bottom line is big nickel over G, in my opinion, is gonna be the best defense in Madden 22. If you want to get my defensive guide, uh, I would encourage you to check out some of the links in the description. I put some stuff down there below uh, that you can kind of get a head start on everybody. But this defense is really, really hard to beat. It really is. Um, and again, you know, real simple. We're getting pressure right off the edge, and then we're just lurking over the middle with our users. So you want to send some heat in Madden 22. You want to get started. This is the best way to start, in my opinion. This defense, from my lab work, is going to be the best defense. Gets the best placement. Does the best against run. Has the best coverage schemes. So try this out. Let me know what you think. And if you want to watch me play Madden 2022. Uh, tonight, then go ahead and text the word Madden to 208-218-6900. You'll get a, uh, a text whenever I go live just for tonight. I'm not going to text you every time I go live, but just for tonight. And then if you also want to sign up to get all of my free schemes that I'm going to be releasing just to my text message members, they're not going on my YouTube channel for everybody to watch. This is exclusive to the text message members, so you have to sign up to get this. Again, text the word Madden to 208-218-6900. Thanks for your time. Thanks for your support, and we'll see you later tonight.